put down the peppermint and step aside spearmint because Perilla is in town. Today's sponsor is Runa. You can visit them online at runa.org. They hooked me up with this t-shirt and a bunch of tea to try, and I have to say, it's uh, really, really delicious. Now, the tea is made um, from the Amazonian Wayusa tree. Uh, it has a good amount of caffeine in it, amino acids, it has vitamins, um, and it's, it's just a really well-balanced cup of tea uh, that doesn't give you the spike in energy and then the you know drop-off in energy that you get from something like coffee. So check them out online at runa.org and give them a shot. So when I was walking through the Asian grocery store, I stumbled upon Perilla, a bright green leaf sold as is. So I bought some to investigate for WTF. As I found out, Perilla is in the same family as mint, and it comes in two varieties, a purple leaf Perilla and green leaf Perilla. It's fairly popular in Asia where it's used as an herb, uh, but it's also used for its oils as in medicine and as a food coloring. In Japan, they call it shiso, and they use it in tempura, sushi, and to pickle things with. Uh, the Koreans extract the oil and use it to cook with, and the Chinese use perilla to cure colds. Basically, any place that you use mint, you can use perilla. Fun fact, perilla is so popular in Asia that Pepsi even put out a version of their drink, perilla flavored. You can use perilla on pizza, in salads, or over pasta, uh, but today we are going to cook some up Vietnamese style. First, roll up your perilla leaves and thinly slice them. This is called a chiffonade. Now cut a cucumber in half lengthwise and then into semicircles. Heat a large flat bottom pan over high heat and then add some vegetable oil. When the oil is hot, add the cucumber and saute until it starts to brown. Now add some crushed arbol chilies and some minced garlic. Stir until they become fragrant. Then add a teaspoon of soy sauce and a teaspoon of rice vinegar. Mix that in. Finally, turn off the heat and add a teaspoon of sesame oil and your perilla. Stir and enjoy. So that is perilla. It's a really delicious, bright, fragrant herb. I hope that you can find it, and if you can, definitely buy some and cook with it. It's a good stuff. Uh, tune in tomorrow for another WTF, and if you have a suggestion that you'd like us to cover, post it in the comments below. See you tomorrow.